right, what's up, my John Doers? And today I'm going to be teaching you all 30 Spanish letters of the Spanish alphabet. All right, it's going to go from, from A to Z or A to Z. <coughs> So, A, A looks like a normal A and is pronounced A, B looks like a normal B and is pronounced B, C looks like a normal C and is pronounced, okay, so pretty much all of these look like normal letters, okay, so C looks like, an, looks, <laughs> C is pronounced as say. D is pronounced as day, E is pronounced as A, F is pronounced as F A, G is pronounced as hey, G's are silent, H is pronounced as ache, because they're silent too, I's are pronounced as E's, J's are pronounced as yota, because you know they're silent too, K is pronounced as ka, you know, like ka, K double A. And then L is LA, M is pronounced as MA, N is pronounced as NA, and then here is their, uh, like, one of their first actual uh, random letters that we don't have. Our English has 26, they have 30. So here's theirs. This is Enye. It, it looks like an N with a tilde above it. Um, yeah, it's pronounced enye. The tilde is, it means like an accent mark, so enye, not ene, it's enye. And then o can be pronounced as o or u. P is pe. Q is ku, like Q W. R is ere. S is esse, kind of like you're writing an essay. T is te. U is u, like u, u, you know. And then, um, sorry, my camera cut out, but, and then, V, V does not have, like, the tough V sound, it's like a B, kind of like you're pronouncing a B, and, yeah, V's are kind of compli complicated, it can be like V, or like B, so it would be pronounced as Uve or B, <clears throat> and then W is doble V, or Uve doble, and then X is Akis. Y is Egriega. That one's tough. I'll have to show it to you. And then Zeta, or Z. I already showed this to you in the beginning, but Z is Zeta. And then here are the three extras. So right now we're at 27. We're going up to 30. Here's the three extras. This this one right here, it's between C and D. It's called Eche. It's a combination between C, H, and E. Eche, that's how you pronounce it there. And then this one right here, this is this is um, right, this is in between L and M. It's L A, two different L's together. This one right here is between R and S, and it's called R. -E. It's pronounced like that. So, get out a pencil and paper right now, and we're gonna play a little game. All right, I have the name. I have a name written down on this piece of paper. I'm gonna spell it out in Spanish. And you guys are gonna try and write down it, write it down, and see if you can get it. All right. So this is a like common Spanish name. The first letter is H. The second letter has a has like one of those side dashes on top of it as an accent mark, and it is A. The third letter is say. The fourth letter is te. The fifth letter is pronounced as o or u. And the last and final letter is pronounced as ere. So, were you able to get it? The name was Hector. Or Hector, Hector, Hector. Yeah, you know. But now we're gonna now we're gonna sing the Spanish alphabet. So we have A B C H A D A F A A J E J A K L L Y M A N A N Y O U P Q R E R 
S T U V B W W U V W Aqui é Y G M Z T T T Don't forget about the L L N And with that, ladies and gentlemen, that right there was the Spanish alphabet, all 30 letters.